Hey, what's up everyone? Sam here. So in this list, I'm going to be showing you five crazy things grown in a lab. Number five, rat limbs. In 2015, researchers at Massachusetts General Hospital successfully managed to grow an entire rat forelimb in their lab. This was the first time this has ever been done. The limb even had working muscle tissue after only 16 days. The way they did it was they took a live rat limb and removed all of its cells. They then were left with a protein framework for the limb. After injecting this structure with live cells, muscle tissue and blood cells started to form. After a few weeks, the rat limb was fully grown and they tested it by applying small electrical charges to the muscle tissue. The end result was a limb that contracted and moved exactly like a naturally grown one. Number 4. Human Pig Embryo Yes, scientists at the Salk Institute successfully grew human cells inside a pig embryo. They did this not to create a strange human-pig hybrid, but rather to see if they could grow human organs inside another animal. If successful, these organs can be used for transplants. However, some people raise some ethical questions regarding this research. In 2015, the US stopped the funding for this kind of research. Number 3. Apple Ears In 2016, Canadian researchers created something truly fascinating. They were able to grow human tissue using apples. Essentially, what they did was remove the existing cells from an apple. Then they cut out an ear-shaped piece of the apple and injected human cells. The cells populated and started to form an ear. The idea behind this research is to create cheaper and easier implants. Number 2. Vaginas in Mexico, four teenagers had a condition where they were born without vaginas. Dr. Anthony Attila managed to grow human vaginas in his lab and implant it into each teenager. He did this by taking a small tissue sample from each girl. He then created a custom biodegradable scaffold and injected it with the cells grown from the tissue samples. The surgeries were completed in 2005 and the women revealed that their lab-grown vaginas operated normally. Number 1. Brains Using stem cells, researchers at Stanford University managed to grow a small mini-brain that was about 4mm in diameter. They even kept the brain alive for two full years. Using hormones, they could coax the tissue to grow into structures that can mimic parts of the brain. This research can help scientists figure out or better understand diseases such as Lou Gehrig disease or other neurodevelopmental disorders. Thank you for watching. To subscribe, click over here. To watch another awesome video, then click down here. Do make sure to turn on channel notifications and follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat. All details are on screen and in the description below. Once again, thank you for watching and until next time, feed your mind.